All right, so my next, uh, next item, it seems like every time I start the video, I got clamps falling off the table. So, all right, the next, uh, next step was to create a, um, a little uh, set of shrinking pliers to get this edge folded a little nicer. And so what I got is a, a pair of vice grips, and I've got three little pieces of metal, and I think my plan is going to be I'm going to create a, in the center, I'm going to create a, let's see if I can get it, kind of like that, a little tooth on the top. And then I am going to weld two other pieces of, of this steel on the bottom. So it'll kind of create like a little, um, a little single finger and two, it'll create two little jaws and it'll kind of crease, fold a crease in the metal kind of like a U-shape and so we'll clamp that down on each of the um, each section of this edge here and that should um, hopefully fold it so uh, what I'll do is I've got my vice grips I'm going to sacrifice uh, I'm going to I cleaned off the metal a little bit here uh, I'm going to clean off some of the plating on this um, on these so I get a good weld and uh, I think we'll just go we'll just start going there Just got the plating off the steel, so it'll take a weld better. So I think, I'm trying to think if it matters which side I do first, because if I, if I do one, I may not be able to get access to the other, and I can't really take these apart because they're riveted, so. Really should bolt this down, but I seem to always find a different spot to move it. So. Those are my big teeth. So I got the pieces of steel cleaned up, and I guess we'll just get to uh, we'll get to welding them in. to the naked eye, but not terrible, right, for a first timer, or seven, whatever, this is my third or fourth time now, uh, it's not terrible, well, it looks a lot better than I did before, so uh, I'm happy with that. first welding accidents under the truck is this cable caught on this you know this thing caught on fire because welding sparks fell down on there so I'm happy to not burn down any more of my tools so hopefully I can get good at this and use it a lot more than the big welder. I imagine the big welder is still pretty useful for a bunch of stuff. If I welded this one kind of at the same angle as the other one, they, they kind of, they don't really c come together in a parallel way. I want them to, you know, pinch kind of like that. And so I'm going to need to figure out how I want to do that or which, uh, I guess, which angle I want to do that at. And I suppose I could angle this one in, uh, I don't know what the, whatever the word is, uh, it's not tangent, but perpendicular to we want this edge to line up with the with the radius on the pliers. So uh, I think, at least, I think that's what I want to do. So I think I think I can grind. I think I can grind that um, at a better angle. But 
I should probably do that now before I load the rest of them. you want more shrinking near the edge of a panel than you would in the front, so that might be, might not be terrible to, to do. Although I gotta make sure I can adjust down enough to get a really, really good bite into it. But yeah, that, that would be plenty. That would work. That would work okay. I guess we can take another pair of ice grips. Well, I guess I can clamp here and then see how it does there. Yeah, see that really bites it at an angle. Where is that? It's more of what I want. Yeah. So that allows me to get the jaws open plenty and close it down. Alright, so yeah, let's get this, let's, we'll just get going. Alright, next one. Still not. Well, I don't know if you can't can't see. Still not the greatest welds, but um, I, they look like they're going to stick together. So we'll see if that. So now you can kind of see these are kind of chomping, kind of chomp the metal. We'll get these to cool down and then see how they work. Let's see. I think I need a back out the can a little bit so we'll see that that does a little bit right. so yeah you can kind of see I think I need to get more pressure on it Definitely shrinking. Or full. Doesn't seem like it's shrinking, it's folding right now. And hopefully, when we start hammering it flat again, it'll be shrinking. So, yeah. That's kind of. That's the idea. So, uh, we'll see if that works. I think I need it to be. I think I need it to. Well, if it shrinks more than that, I mean, I suppose that's about what I want. Um, and so, we'll see how that we'll see how that works. I may want to like I want bigger folds in there, but maybe I actually don't because then they'll be harder to remove. So, all right, let's try that. 